Hi, and thanks for logging on to the Daily Dvar, and here's a brand new halacha for you, and it's for Friday the 27th day of January. Here we go. Today, a halacha, follow up on something we were discussing two or three days ago about glasses that become broken on Shabbos. Here's today's particular case. Sometimes it happens that the, the glass, uh, the lens, which is usually held in place kind of tightly, the glasses are getting stretched or old or whatever, and the 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 lens is just kind of every once in a while slipping out of its place because the pressure that's holding it in place is kind of slipping. And if your glasses are in that condition and the lens just kind of pops out frequently, popping that lens back in on Shabbos, according to most rabbis, is not a problem because you're not really fixing the glasses and doing a real, real fix which is one of the 39 things you're not allowed to do on Shabbos, is not considered a real permanent fix because you know that you've been popping that back in a couple times a week and it's been falling out and until it gets tightened it's really not much of a fix. So in that situation putting the lens back in on Shabbos would be allowed because you're not really accomplishing a fix. Now, but if your glasses were fine and someone just kind of bopped you and that made the lens pop out, now you know that it's going to take some force and pressure and if you do get the lenses back in, they may stay there permanently because nothing's wrong with the glasses, just pressure had popped it out. Strong pressure will pop it back in and it will stay. Can you do that on Shabbos? That's a debate amongst the rabbis. You'd have to speak to your own personal rabbi to get guidance on this because some great rabbis say yes and some say no in that circumstance. Some say it's viewed as a permanent fix because you know, it's tight and they are going to stay in place probably if you pop them back in and some say no. You know, I'm laughing because if your glasses become broken, the frame, like let's say right here, right down the middle, the glasses just crack in half, then it's pretty clear that you're not allowed to do anything. They, they become muktzah at that point. They have no Shabbos purpose. They can't be worn. You're not allowed to tape them back together with a big giant piece of duct tape that looks ugly. You're not going to be allowed to do that. And therefore, those glasses are muktzah for the rest of Shabbos. And I'm sorry you're in a bit of a jam because you won't be able to fix them. You won't be able to wear them. It's not even so simple about even moving them. Uh, maybe, maybe just uh, gently kick them to the side. You, but you're not really allowed to carry them, handle them, and walk them around. So just maybe uh, kind of slide them to the side with the side of your foot where they won't get stepped on. But you're not allowed to move them, fix them, or anything when your frames are all broken on Shabbos. Thanks for logging on. Log on again after Shabbos for more. Have a great Shabbos. Bye-bye.